My amazing Librans, welcome into a monthly money and career tarot reading for you for the month of September 2024. We're beginning with an overall uh, channeled message straight from Spirit of massive financial increase. These rewards will change your life and I feel the need to finish that off with for the better, okay? Um, it feels as if Spirit's saying this will be a busy month for you where things start to increase or continue to do so in a very positive direction. Um, you will be receiving rewards once again, left and right. Your hard work is paying off throughout the month uh, in regards to what you've been working on and putting effort and resources towards from the past and throughout this month period. Um, I'm not saying it's going to be a perfect month because that is just, that's life, all right? And I'd be leading you astray um, by saying that. But it does feel like when certain distractions and obstacles and I want to say noise factors come to be, maybe energy factors otherwise, take a deep breath and trust in the process. Uh, process, excuse me. Um, but it does feel like you will as well need to trust in the mystery. I don't know why I feel the need to say that in regards to getting an opportunity, um, in, in regards to um, the options being narrowed down for some, if you're looking for, I want to say a housing situation, maybe a car, um, being two main ones that are coming through. Could as well be in regards to looking for a job, okay? Um, or a new office space is what I just heard. Um, I'm not going to take the Six of Cups, but it does feel like this is speaking upon donations, commission for some, um, extra hours adding up to obviously a uh, financial increase. Now, someone uh, definitely drawn to the reading is gaining a massive um, deposit into their account or a massive check in the mail or uh, gifted to you by hand. Um, and this is going to support an investment of importance. Whether you're putting that money or a good chunk of that money towards um, that investment for the near future throughout this month period, or you're gaining the insight, the clarity, and maybe the uh, couple of different or few different solid options in regards to that choice that you're meant to make in the upcoming month or two. But um, thinking back to what you've accomplished is what I just heard because it feels like your life gets so busy as we definitely take this card, um, but it feels like your life gets so busy and maybe feels nonstop for a lot drawn to the reading, which I can relate to. Um, even, you know, when you're not accomplishing and wrapped up with this and that of importance for your career and finances and otherwise in life, the, the upstairs department known as your Libra in mind definitely is still churning, okay? Uh, processing, reflecting, and thinking about the future. Um, and how to solve is what I just heard. The Queen of Cups coming out. It feels like there's an advancement kind of energy about you and when it comes to what you produce and develop. Um, but it also feels like there's a maturity and uh, an emotionally fulfilling and stable way about you. You are speaking things very solidly into existence and I wouldn't be surprised if this is at least partially speaking upon your um, assisting, okay, your helpful nature coming into play. Even if that's not, say, the majority of what your position at work entails or even your business entails, you are helping people at certain points throughout the month of September and it's leaving you with more rewards, more results in progress coming to be. They just showed uh, the Wheel of Fortune card in this deck and the wheel actually churning in the imagery, you know, as if the card kind of came to life. Um, but I also feel like your dreams are significant. Yeah, okay, your dreams and goals in life and, and how those are changing and developing and being tweaked as we speak and proceed through uh, September, but your actual dreams, your daydreams as you are, again, quite busy and staying active, but when you're sleeping, okay, as I'm pointing to the bed, um, whether it's a nap or at night or both, it's just as if there are a lot of vivid dreamers being drawn to the reading. And at least part of those, uh, or some of those are going to be intertwined with pertaining to your money and or career at that time. Um, whew, as I just completely lost my breath, um, it may happen to at a certain point throughout the month, but uh, they're saying you may be pushed to remember, as I'm seeing the Six of uh, Cups again, a significant dream or two from the past, you know, rewinding uh, before September that had to do with your money and or career. But to continue, um, they're drawing me to this water crown. It feels as if there's a royalty about you that's um, being expressed, it's being utilized. People are seeing you in that nature. 
um, in that energy. It's as if you're very, very talented being drawn to this reading and that's being put to use. Spirit's saying, you don't know the half of it. It feels like you may think you do. I have the full picture, the full imagery and uh, clarity about your future, your destiny, the, um, the outcome of your career, but you don't know half of it. Um, it feels like that was an exact message for some, but it feels like there's uh, more skill sets or one in particular, more talent to be discovered within you uh, and outside of you. But the Four of Pentacles coming out because I really feel as if there's a focus on your savings. Yes, there's, uh, there's significant spending taking place, but where can you tighten up uh, when it comes to spending? Where can you uh, save more? But um, it does feel like as well, oh, bear with me, energy is affecting you spiritually and otherwise. Um, remembering as well, items have and hold uh, energy. But I do want to say that you are um, holding your cards close to your chest, Libra. Why is that? And I'm now being shown the Seven of uh, Swords because you don't trust everybody, because you at times don't um, have all the answers or know what's happening behind closed doors. And so therefore you're treading more so carefully um, throughout the month of September. Okay, I don't see that as a bad thing, but it does feel like all the meanwhile, you may need to, as I'm being drawn to how her face is uh, turned to the side, turn away from certain people, okay? Maybe turn a blind eye is what I'm getting, but as well, I do feel like there may be an opportunity or two to pick up an extra shift or um, do something uh, through your business for somebody, provide a service or a product. You might need to turn it down, okay? Um, say, for example, if I'm to get an opportunity to do a reading for somebody and their energy doesn't uh, you know, sit well with me or um, I'm too busy, you know what I'm saying? Something of the sort is gonna come into play. Um, it may as well be the energy in that work situation uh, for that period of time. Now, I did decide to pre-pull three other energies on the board while I had to take a quick second due to some noise and energy shifts, um, but I got the Page of Swords. I'm not surprised to see this for whatever reason because I feel as if there's knowledge intake taking place, there's informing, you know, um, heading towards you being digested and utilized, but as well I wouldn't be surprised if you're as well informing one if not multiple people or maybe a demographic or two uh, or three at most uh, throughout this period. Um, it feels like some of which are predictive in nature, you work with energy, um, while energy obviously naturally affects you uh, for the better and for the worse. Well, there's a focus on a happily ever after for you. I really feel as if somebody's getting a new place to reside, to live, uh, securing that, locking it down as the wording coming through. Um, I'm not surprised as well to hear that somebody's getting an employment opportunity. It could be within the same uh, place or uh, company business that you work for. Um, somebody shifting to a different department uh, or maybe even getting a pay raise, but somebody's getting a whole new job. Excellent, excellent. And again, I'm getting somebody's getting um, uh, the keys um, to a new business location, okay? Maybe a storefront uh, or it definitely is for somebody a place to uh, quietly and safely run your business. But it does feel like somebody as well drawn to the reading is learning about how that job situation is changing, okay? Because it feels like I'm hearing there's anticipation in the air um, in regards to when something's going to uh, finish uh, or begin, how something's going to proceed. Um, it feels like there's rules and regulations changing up where you're working. And it feels like this is a, kind of a laughing matter for some. Um, it definitely is something I can relate to where things are at my serving job. Hopefully nobody from that job watches this. Um, are taken so seriously and uh, you know it's uh, this kind of lockdown way of you have to do things this way you have to charge the customers for this this and that um, no matter what and then at the end of the day they're now changing things and it, it just is it's kind of a laughing matter anyways there's also creative ideas coming into play being plopped into your mind by spirit and um, I feel as if this is going to really help you uh, adjust adapt and accomplish throughout the month of September you can feel it in my energy where I'm not really forcing it, but it does feel like throughout the month you are on point, okay? It does feel like there are need, uh, there's going to be a need for um, a break or two throughout the month where something's heavily affecting you, right? Or in a nervous way affecting you, or you just need to catch your breath, or you're meant to and need to step away from that work situation, 
that accomplishment or maybe where you're living in the moment. Um, and I feel as if somebody's stepping into a store to potentially buy something and the energy sucks. Okay, I'm just going to say it. It sucks. It's because of who's shopping there and maybe the energy as well in regards to who's working. Just being completely real. Um, as I do need to catch my breath, somebody nearby, excuse me, um, has bad energy. But the three of pentacles, because I feel as if this is a time period where you're being noticed, okay? You're gaining attention for your work, for um, being talented. One second. But I also want to say with the seven of pentacles on the board, you are watering things of importance and again, seeing the results, the rewards flowing in for you and things increasing as they're showing a ball of yarn, uh, definitely from this three of pentacles imagery, um, uh, adding up, okay, kind of a snowballing sort of uh, imagery. If you think about um, a snowball going down a hill, but it does feel like um, a foundation, your roots are paying off for you. You're going to be feeling as if you are meant to be gaining more clarity throughout this time and moving forward in regards to what lies ahead for you in regards to things changing and ending up a hell of a lot better. But I want to say as well, you do need to think about uh, switching up where you're working for the future for somebody because I don't see that job uh, getting any better. Okay. It may as well get worse in regards to new management, new structure, new uh, changes in regards to something that was implemented recently um, getting worse for you. Okay. Um, as well, I feel as if there's somebody that you wish to see fired or quit and I don't see them leaving. Okay. Things have changed. Um, but I do as well feel as if you're going to be getting to know yourself better throughout the month of September in regards to how to be even more so uh, better accomplish to um, see things easier for you. You're going to be getting to know yourself better through the act of working through the act of managing your finances. Now, I'm not saying it's a month where you can't be treating yourself with little purchases here and there and whatnot, but I do feel as if you're going to need to buckle down and think about your future in regards to how to save in regards to yeah, how, how you best save for yourself, um, knowing yourself best at this point, but as well in regards to future obligations. Okay. I do feel the need to mention there are certain um, expected and unexpected, uh, you know, uh, charges and um, obligations and, and whatnot uh, lying ahead for you. <laughs> How is my voice shakes? But I feel as if you're going to need to be prepared for those, right? Um, when they do end up costing you a pretty penny. But um, there are going to be moments where you're pushed to look a different way for a sense of informing, okay? Maybe for a sense of distraction. When you feel at work or maybe at home for somebody or maybe in a storefront, that conversation is going nowhere good uh, or maybe, uh, yeah, it's involving gossip, I want to say, or just uh, shit talking is the wording coming through step away even if you have to cut them off even if you have to stop in mid uh your mid sentence you need to walk away okay pretend or come up with something that you have to accomplish in that exact moment because they're saying things uh, create sticky situations moving forward or one in particular and things could come back to bite you in the behind um and i'm also hearing in a job situation specifically people have loose lips um be careful who you mention your business to for somebody because I do sense that somebody could um, bring bad energy to it, okay? Or um, maybe try to taint it or, uh, okay, for somebody, I'm getting specifically put a spell on it. Anyways, ignore that message if it's not for you, but you're being viewed at as a star, okay? There are times in the remainder of the month where you're strategically connecting and disconnecting naturally, and this is working to your advantage. It's weird because... You could tell how I was uh, shaking in my voice and nervous and kind of stiff due to energy um, at a certain point uh, for a period of time during this reading. Now I'm feeling better. I just don't get it at times. Uh, but they're saying you're going to be feeling, even if you're not one to be an empath, uh, you're going to be feeling the energy shifting for the better and uh, or for the worst throughout, say, that work day, that work week, uh, throughout that period of time where you're living, where you're shopping, or even where you're migrating, let's just, uh, you know, put it uh, in those words uh, to go to that point. But it does feel like your hopes, your dreams, your wishes are coming into play because they're possible. Sit for a hot second in your intuition, uh, what you're feeling accurately in that moment, 
and ask yourself, well, how do I proceed uh, in the correct, uh, better direction for myself? Um, I don't know if I should accomplish this now. Well, what are you feeling otherwise? Okay, um, because it feels as if this will help you buckle down and accomplish in that moment or delay it till a different time. But it does feel like you're going to as well need to think about your connection to your work and apply yourself in a different way. Maybe get back to the basics. Well, let's wrap up this reading by uh, saying once again, spirit saying there's massive financial increase and these rewards will change your life. Okay.